Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today I'm going to show you how I make my fried green plantains Jamaican style. And all you need is one or two green plantains and a presser. I like when my plantains are a little turn, that means they're just starting to get ripe. And for my presser, I use any, anything that is smooth at the bottom. As long as it's smooth at the bottom, Anything that is smooth at the bottom, you can improvise if you don't have a plantain presser. So I'm going to go ahead and start preparing my plantains and then we'll go right ahead. So I cut off the ends of my plantain. Cut off both ends. And then I'm going to mark it down on the side. Cut it down on the side. And on the other side, we can give it two, one cut or two cuts. I always like to give it two. And then I'm gonna get take the plantain out of the, the skin. Just take care to open it. Okay. Because, okay, this is good. One side is off. And now I take the next side off and I'm being very caref careful because I'm going to show you how this, the skin of the plantain will become very, can become very helpful or very useful because when, when I usually observe my mom cooking, um, doing plantains, I usually see her just use the skin to press it so that is one one option to press it so I'm gonna put this aside I'm not sure if I'm gonna be using it but I'm keeping it so that I can maybe show you the old Jamaican way old traditional way the way I see my mom doing it I'm gonna scrape off any additional thing from the skin so now I have my plant in peel and I'm only starting with one I'm going to cut my plantain into pieces and we're going to cut them slightly diagonal one two okay, three four so we have five pieces we cut them diagonal and what we're going to do we're going to start frying these plantain so i heat my pan on medium temperature and i use about a quarter cup of vegetable oil i like to fry with vegetable oil so but you can use any oil of your choice but i like to fry with vegetable oil so i eat my pan at medium temperature and I'm going to allow my plantain to fry for until they have a nice golden golden color I don't want them to be too I don't I just want them to halfway fry at this point Remember it was two plantains, you can spread them out in the pot. Keep the temperature on medium. And just allow them to fry on both sides. And you can check the progress as they continue to fry okay and at this point this is exactly how you want your planting to look so we're going to remove these from the from the pan and then we'll continue with the pressing so i've removed the planting from the pan and i put them on paper towel so as to get rid of the 
excess oil and now I'm going to start with the pressing them. Let's go ahead and start pressing the planting. Remember, the planting presser would be the ideal, but let's try and see which one of these is going to give us. Remember, as long as the bottom is smooth, Okay, so this is the the mug. Now let's try the let's try the glass. Let's remove it carefully so that it doesn't crumble. So here we have the one from the glass. Let's try the plate. Looks good. And finally, we are going to try the, the plantain skin and see so so we have all different different things you can use remember if you can get all of the plant in presser, it would be ideal. So I'm going to go ahead and finish pressing them and then we'll continue with the process. Now my plantings are ready for the next step. So the next step would, would be to sprinkle salt over the plantings. So that is what we usually see our parents do back home in Jamaica. They sprinkle salt and that is an option, but I'm not sprinkling salt. I'm going to go ahead and dip my plantains into garlic salt mixture, just garlic salt and water. So I'm going to dip them inside. Because I believe when, when we, I, I don't really like the salt grain on anything that I'm doing. And uh, also, well, yes, the salt would dissolve into the oil when you're frying it again. But I just like the way they taste, you know, having that garlic, garlic taste. I just love that. So that is why I'm doing it here. So I'm going to. Dip all of them into the water and then we'll continue. So remember that after you press the planting, you have one or of two choices. You had a sprinkle salt over it or you can use the garlic salt water it's up you do whichever one suits you i use the garlic salt water today and now i'm gonna fry these plantains again put them back in the pot and let them get that golden crispy and golden medium heat Smells so good with that garlic.
So you allow them to fry on medium heat until you get a nice crispy golden look. So we're just going to let them continue to fry. And then I remove them after they fry the second time. I remove them from the pan and put them on paper towel to get rid of the ex excess oil. Oh, I just love the authentic look of these plantains. Please remember to like, share, subscribe. And remember to get all your plant-based vitamins and supplements. Please check out my shop. The link is on my channel home page. Thanks for watching. Enjoy.